Welcome to the Clothing Prime. <laughs> A little better, I guess. Um, hey everybody, this is Callum from Tacubin. We are going to take a look at uh, two toiletry bags in this video. So this is a comparison video between the Eagle Creek Wallaby toiletry bag and the Eagle Creek Quick Trip toiletry bag. Um, we did separate videos for each of these. Uh, in this video, we wanted to give you a sense of how they compare. Um, we've packed the Wallaby to <laughs> pretty much its fullest. Uh, and we wanted to see just how much of this stuff that we packed in here can actually fit in the Eagle Creek uh, Quick Trip bag, the smaller one. Uh, so this is the one we've been using primarily for all of our trips. And then we thought on one of our weekend trips that this is just a little bit of an overkill. Uh, we needed something a little smaller, just pack basics that we need for that small uh, or shorter trip. And so we got ourselves uh, this Quick Trip bag. But you may be in the same position where you're trying to decide between the two and, and seeing you know, how, which, which bag will be the best for you. So hopefully this video helps. Uh, let's get right down to it. You can see the size difference. I, I don't have measurements at this point. I would venture to say, you know, I know this is 10 inches. This is probably closer to 12 inches. I know that this is five and a half inches wide. Um, this one is probably around seven, six, seven inches wide for the wallaby. And I know that the height here uh, from bottom to top is about three and a half to four inches, uh, depending on what you pack. And this is, well, this is quite a bit bigger, probably double the size. So six, seven, eight inches. Uh, and remember, we've really stuffed this, right? But um, so, on the outside, you can tell there's no external pockets for the wallaby. Everything is just kept inside. What you do have is this hook. That's when you know this is really serious, <laughs> when you have a hook. Uh, but we'll, we'll, we'll open this up and you'll get a better sense of that. And you also have a top handle, which is good. Um, that's found also on the Quick Trip. You get the same kind of band, same width band, it's the same band actually. Uh, just a little shorter, but it's top handle nonetheless. It allows you to kind of carry it around. But on the Quick Trip, where you do get our two external pockets, uh, both lengthwise, one mesh, which is nice, you can air things out, uh, and one is not, but it has that water lining, or water resistant lining, I should say. Um, that's the exterior of the bag. They're both, they're both made out of the same material, 300 Dillon, uh, denier, fabric um, it kind of picks up these scuffs as you can see from here not a big deal for us um, if that bothers you they do also have these models in different fabrics uh, so look for the Eagle Creek Spectre Wallaby and the Eagle Creek Spectre um, or Sport Quick Trip okay now finally we get that out of the way let's go into the bag itself and how much we've been able to pack in this thing all right, so this guy up here. <laughs> it's got two zipper pulls, right? Another sign that it is very serious, indeed. And we're gonna open this up here. You can see it's got several things going on, right? Uh, now we have, again, done an individual video for this, but we'll go through this again. Um, so you have a transparent bag or trans, yeah, transparent toiletry bag. Uh, if the TSA says, hey, we need to see exactly what kind of liquids you're packing in there, you can easily remove it and say, sure, here you go, put it through the x-ray or what have you. Uh, but it's pretty nice, it's, uh, it's pretty easy to attach and reattach as needed. But there's that. You have three of the pockets that are the same size, allowing you to kind of store different things. And we'll show you what we have in there. You have one smaller uh, little slot there on the side. Two of them actually. Symmetry is good. Um, and then you have this internal zippered compartment. And pack a bunch more stuff. You'll notice the lining color here. Uh, it's the same throughout. It's actually the same lining that's found in the Quick Trip too. We're getting ahead of ourselves, so let's continue on with the wallaby. Uh, on this side, what you have is a mesh pocket. Okay, 
Um, so nice, you can get some air in there, but you essentially get three zippered internal compartments within the wallaby. Uh, this is a mirror that we've blocked out, uh, just so it won't distract you uh, in this video. But now that we have this, we packed this full, uh, maybe with some redundancy, a little bit too much, but let's just see what we have in here and, and how much we can transfer to this quick trip that we have here. Okay, so let's start with this compartment. So we have a sunscreen, a comb, face cleaner, something makeup looking, um, hair thing. This looks like a, ah, yes, brushes. I don't know if this will fit, but we'll have there, uh, there. I don't know what that is. More stuff for the ladies. Okay, and then foundation is it? Don't quiz me on makeup. I will fail that badly. Creamy eye treatment. Okay, that's that one's in English. Um, nail clipper. I'm not even sure if these are allowed on planes, but I mean, it's so small. Um, little hair pin. Thing that okay, sure we'll, we'll take out for now. I'm sure that'll have no problem fitting in the quick trip. Um, so, oh, and then one more. Um, lip balm. Terribly sorry for the interruption, guys. Our battery, <laughs> our camera ran out of battery, so uh, we have to charge it up for a minute. And uh, we left everything in place, so let's continue on. We've taken out everything from this compartment or this section of the bag, and we uh, have this stuff. So now let's continue with this side. Let's get these things out. Uh, face wash, shampoo, conditioner, more shampoo and conditioner, sunscreen, uh, some more makeup, some more sunscreen. <clears throat> and now uh, we have our last section here. Some nice new toothbrushes. Toothpaste, floss, keep your mouth clean, keep your lip uh, moisturized. Is that where it is? is. Uh, shavers, lotion. We, we have way too much stuff. We pack too much. My gosh. And that's it, I think, yeah, yep, all right. Now, everything that we had in the wall of is out on the table. Let us see how much of all this we can fit in this little guy. So, this is a bit of a challenge. Let us start with, any bets? 10 of these items, 20, 15. I would say about 20. Yeah, let's go with 20. So, uh, I'd like to go with the flat things first. So you can see the Quick Trip has this kind of nice flat surface. Uh, we're gonna pack that in first, maximize that space. So we have one thing here. Another thing there. Let's see, we have some more room maybe for this comb. Yeah, this comb will fit in nicely. And there's our base. Okay. Uh, and I have this brush set that's in there. That takes up quite a bit of volume right there. Um, we have a couple of sunscreen lotion. Do we need it all, right? Um, I say we could probably just try to pack these two the face and then the sport. Try to pack like that there on the side. Um, makeup stuff. These are, I put in this foundation on this side. 
thingamajig here. Uh, this is kind of big makeup. Okay, it's, it's doing okay so far. I've lost track of how many things we had. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. We have nine things in there. All right, so I think we can reach 20. Um, there's more room. Let's pack this thing in here. Okay, oh, we have a channel of space here. Um, this lotion, sure. No, we don't want that. Let's put this in. Like that. Like this, okay. Uh, actually, this would be better off if it sat on top of the keels. Have that there. Still enough to close it. Good. Okay, that's good. Quite a bit going on. Uh, these kind of thin, small things would probably stick on the side, so we'll, we'll leave these kind of things for now. These two will be on the mesh side. This one can be over here. This can be over here. More of the fat round things. Uh, we only need one floss, right? So let's take that one. Um, Band-aid will probably fit in on that side. Do we already have a toothpaste? We have a toothpaste, so we don't need this. We will need at least one set of shampoo and conditioner, which I think we fit in here. It's just kind of, yeah, we're, we're just kind of able to squeeze all these things in here. Um, no, that's a duplicate there too. Shaver. Probably have to go with this one. Um, and then a small deodorant. A small deodorant, we could try to fit in here. What do you guys think? Does this zip up? I don't know. Oh, look at that. Okay. It's very, <laughs> it's very packed in there. Uh, but you can see it's a nice form. There's actually no slouch as soon as I pick this up. Sometimes, you know, these will kind of pinch in. This is not doing that. Uh, we've, we've really packed that in. Okay, now there's still some space in here. We're gonna try to squeeze in, you know, some of these thinner, smaller items. This is gonna be, this might be too much for the bag. But there's that. I think that's about it, lip balm. Okay, now let's try to... Yeah, I mean, that still fits. And then now let's get these toothbrushes in. And the toothbrushes are in. That's quite impressive. That's way over 20 items, right? Um, we Most of the things we'd lost out on are the duplicate kind of, kind of things. So, you know, things we already have in there. Oh, this thing. This again, kind of open up. Okay, that's good. And then the shaver. Is it possible? Could it be? Wow. All right. That's that's pretty cool. That's pretty much everything we had in here. We have deodorant in there. We have the shampoo and conditioner. Just use a little bit less every time you use it. You know, you can get by. You don't need power shaver. Just use the good old manual razor. Band-aid we have in there, toothpaste we have in there. Just use less of everything. We're good to go. I mean, this is makeup. This is, you know, your daily essentials. This is, this is awesome. This is the Eagle Creek Quick Trip bag. And it pretty much packed everything the Wallaby did for us in a much smaller size. That's pretty cool. All right, guys. Thank you very much for watching. If you have any questions, let us know. We'll be using both of these bags. This one maybe in a different color. We'll see. But uh, let us know if you have any questions, your thoughts, comments. 
people seem to love this bag online. Uh, we're starting to too. Uh, we certainly have enjoyed using this bag, but we can get away with something smaller by all means. Um, that's pretty cool. So there you have it. Hope this video helps. Thank you very much for watching. Shout out to Kenya.